Queen Lyndon Arthur is back, ready to stake a claim for a shot at world glory when he takes on Argentina's Walter Gabriel Shekiera. Part of a huge night of action on Saturday, September the 17th. It's live and free on Channel 5. Okay, this is Harry Judd for Boxing Social in association with Bet Fred. We're here in Bolton Wanderers Ground. I'm glad to be joined by James Warcroft. What a good bounce back that was. A TKO victory. You must be delighted, mate. Oh, it's amazing. Thank you so much, mate. You know, taking a huge fight like I did last time, it was great to get back out there. You know, I've seen his record. He's eight stoppages and 16 wins. Not so many. And I'm thinking he's, he's going to be a good fight. But, you know, like I've said on a few other times, Anthony, we worked the game plan. It probably come a little bit earlier than expected, but everything Anthony put into practice there tonight was, was amazing. And my, my strength and conditioning coach, Martin Cole, have been working on a lot more power this time. You know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a very good out and in boxer, in and out boxer. I was looking at settling down, sitting down on my punches tonight, and it prevailed, thank, thank God. <laughs> you must be delighted, but you know, would you have liked more rounds in there tonight? Yeah, definitely, definitely, you know. I felt the stoppage was coming, but I'd have liked a few more rounds, but you know. You can't, you can't think, you know, I think he, he cut his eye on the inside off, the, off, off an uppercut, so we can't, I can't expect him to carry on from that, you know. I don't know, I don't know what um, he'll do tonight, but, you know, thank you so much to him and all his team for coming here and having a good fight. I was, I'm really happy with that, mate. You've teamed up with quite a lot, it's been quite a while now, but can you get, go through a little bit of what you've been working on in terms of what, you know, the relationship that you've got working together? Well, listen, Anthony is a lot behind the scenes. Everyone sees Anthony as just this, you know, major guy who's won everything in boxing that, is, that you can that you can get but he's not the guy's compassionate he looks after all his fighters he's on the phone 24 7 you know if i can't get in he's moving times around for me and stuff like that he really goes out of his way to make sure that we get the best training that there possibly is and i can't thank him enough for that i can't thank him enough for the effort he puts into not just me all the fighters jake james rihanna everyone and you know he's an absolute top guy and you know absolutely amazing guy so it's great to to listen and be, be like gaining knowledge from him 24-7 it's something that it's, it's priceless it's, it's literally priceless you can't pay for it I, when, when he decided he, he wanted to like, work with me you know he was like oh my Christmas has come at once but we're looking forward to moving forward now and I want these domestic titles now and let's let's push on I'm very new to the sport I've only been here seven years picked up a glove seven years ago so I'm ready to push on now and you know this is these are the nights I want to be involved in. I'm ready, mate. I'm ready. You've been commended for your character. Obviously, disappointment last time out. How difficult has it been to, to get back on the horse and get back in the ring after last out? It was difficult, you know. We've done a few... Di Listen, I got beat by a phenomenal fighter on the night. What a guy. You know, he messaged me today saying good luck. You know, what an amazing guy John McGuez was. The guy's a phenomenal fighter. I believe few aspects from my point of view which I could have handled myself a little bit differently I'm not saying it would have changed the decision in any way but you know we did the weight a little bit differently this time I was big in there tonight we you know did things a little bit different you know first plat first time on matchroom platform it was just you know Kerman's fans were just going crazy I'm not saying we voted it would been any different at all but it was just what a night and what a night to be involved in I'll take that to my grave with me you know biggest platform it was great mate it was great but Got back on the horse and we worked hard. Had a 10 week deep camp, put rights wrong, listened to Anthony a bit more <laughs> and, it, and it paid off, mate, it paid off. You must be really thankful, like I said before the interview, there's an army of James Woodcroft yeah, yeah. fans behind me. How thankful are you or all yeah, the people that come out tonight? Like I said, these guys are paying their hard earned money. This moment in time, it's times are hard, you know, with everything that's going on. You know, the Queen, the queen unfortunately died last week, so rest in peace to the Queen. Um, but. These are spending their hard money and it's not cheap, you know, so I can't thank these guys enough. These are, you know, it's unbelievable. It humbles me every single day. I wake up in the morning and I just feel, you know, these guys are spending their hard money. Not, not just that, just messaging me, just, oh, are you all right today, James? Right? What, what an amazing thing to be and I can't thank these guys enough. Without these, I'd be nobody. And in terms of one of your mates, Mark Efron fights next week. Yeah, 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 how excited are you for that one? Manchester Arena, it's going to be a phenomenal fight. Unfortunately, I'm not here for it, otherwise I'd be there with him. But, you know, Mark's worked hard for what he's got and he's a phenomenal fighter and I'm looking forward to him pushing on now because he's going right to the top, Mark. I'm a good friend with Mark, out of the gym as well, so it's great to, um, to watch it, watch it. And I look up to guys like that and if I can get where he's been, I'll be massively, massively buzzing with myself. 
Well, thanks on to Boxing Social, James. I said I'd let you go, because like I said, there's an army behind me, but thanks again, mate. This September, bad blood will be settled. This is more than person. The long-awaited trilogy. There's real bad blood here. Canelo versus Triple G. September 17th, live on DAZN pay-per-view. Visit DAZN.com.